What's up guys? Today I'm going to show you how I did this Northern Lights effect. It's probably one of the coolest shots I've ever done in all my filming. Um, I freaking love it. It went viral on the internet, got millions of views, and I want to show you guys how I did it. Um, I got this footage back when I was in Norway last September. I was in Lofoten, rain, and then I headed over to Senja, and that's where I got this shot on the cliffs there. Um, I spent the night on some cliff and waited for the Northern Lights to show up, so it was freaking awesome. But before I get started, I have a website, and I have Northern Lights time-lapse footage. I'm giving away seven time-lapses for only $5. Um, that's super good deal, considering that most stock footage sell one video for like 50 bucks. Instead, I'm giving away seven videos for $5. Freaking good deal, and that way you can try this effect on your videos, or even just use the time-lapses for your videos. But anyways, let's get into this tutorial. So I'm in Adobe Premiere, and here's the raw video. I shot this right during sunset as the sun was going down. And then here's the time lapse of the Northern Lights. I got this time lapse right at um, the exact same spot where I shot the drone shot, but I did it just about an hour later, and I did it with my Sony camera. And that time lapse took about 10 minutes came and then it left real fast but uh, it looks freaking awesome I love how it turned out so anyways so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna drag that time-lapse on top of the drone footage and then I'm gonna go over to the circular masking tool and I'm gonna make a circular mask I'm gonna maneuver it move it around uh, adjust it move the position a little bit and then I'm gonna feather it to make it blend in Okay, so I'm just gonna kind of play around with this mask, making it blend. And see in this right corner, I have like those mountains there. So I'm just gonna grab some proportions from that Norway shot and bring it up. Okay, just playing around with that. All right, and then I'm gonna go. Actually, I'm gonna zoom in on this shot, make it a little bit bigger, and then I'm gonna move it over just a tad bit. So sweet. So here's what it looks like when we're done. Okay, so it looks awesome, but I do have a problem. You can see these, uh, like the, the shadow of the mountain over there, then these lights. So what I'm gonna do to get rid of it is I'm gonna copy and paste the bottom layer. Then I'm gonna drag it on top of all the videos. And then I'm gonna go over the mask and I'm gonna make a mask of the bottom half. And this is gonna really help those mountains stick out as well as that horizon, as well as myself. Okay, so I'm just gonna kinda of play around with it, making sure that that right side over there is covered up. Okay, that's looking good, looking good. All right, I'm gonna feather a little bit more. Okay, and you can see, you can see the difference between having it and have not having it. Uh, big difference, makes it look a lot more natural and better and yeah I mean that's about it I mean I could go into more but uh, for right now that's the simple version all right so now let's take a look at the shot okay that's freaking awesome this is like money money shot and I mean that didn't really take me that long to do it took me about five minutes not too long Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any more questions, comment down below. Don't be afraid to go check out my website. Get yourself those Norway time-lapse footage. $5. I'm giving away seven of them. So go give that a peep. Go check out my Norway vlogs. They're pretty dope. Go behind the scenes a little bit more. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. It is Ryan Shirley, and we will see you later.